Hi everybody, it's Mrs. C from room 10 and I am going to be reading you a story today called Over in the Garden by Jennifer Ward. So before we read, I just want you to take a quick peek at the front cover and use your picture power to think about what kinds of things we might see over in the garden. You have some ideas in your head? Okay, keep those ideas in your head as we read this story. Here we go. Over in the Garden by Jennifer Ward. Wait a second, there's one more thing we have to look at first. There's two bumblebees here that are telling us something. Hey kids, look for the numbers hidden on each page. Hmm, let's think about that too while we're reading this story. Over in the garden, in the early morning sun, lived a mother praying mantis and her little mantis one. Pounce, said the mother. I pounce, said the one. So they pounced and they hunted in the early morning sun. Over in the garden where the sunflowers grew lived a mother ladybug and her little beetles too. Crawl, said the mother. We crawl, said the two. So they crawled over petals where the sunflowers grew. Over in the garden, near the old shady tree, lived a mother dragonfly and her little dragons, three. Zip, said the mother. We zip, said the three. So they zipped and they zoomed near the old shady tree. Over in the garden, on the damp, earthy floor, lived a quiet mother snail and her baby snails, Four. Slither, said the mother. We slither, said the four. So they slithered and they slid on the damp, earthy floor. Over in the garden where the apple blossoms thrive lived a colony of bees and their little bees. What number is going to come next? Five. Buzz, said the workers. We buzz, said the five. So they buzzed and they flew where the apple blossoms thrive. Over in the garden where the vines and berries mix lived a little mother spider and her baby spiders, six. Jump, said the mother. We jump, said the six. So they jumped through the garden where the vines and berries mix. Over in the garden, where the flowers grow toward heaven, lived a mother butterfly and her caterpillar seven. Hmm. A butterfly and her babies are caterpillars. Why aren't they butterflies? That's right. Because butterflies start out as caterpillars, right? Nibble, said the mother. We nibble, said the seven. So they nibbled and they climbed where the flowers grow toward heaven. Over in the garden by the old wooden gate lived a mother roly-poly and her little babies eight. Roll, said the mother. We roll, said the eight. So they rolled and they curled by the old wooden gate. Over in the garden on a long curly vine crawled a group of soldier ants and their little workers nine. March, said the soldiers. We march, said the nine. So they marched and they crawled up the long curly vine. Over in the garden where the moon shines again lived a mother firefly and her little beetles. Ten. Glow, said the mother. We glow, said the ten. So they glowed and they flash where the moon shines again.
the end. So I wonder if some of your predictions about what you might see in a garden were right. I wonder if you could use your picture power from this front cover to think about what we might have seen in that story. And I also wonder if you were able to pick up on all those numbers and which numbers were coming next in the story, right? There was a lot of rhyming in there too. So we are actually going to do a fun activity with this. Um, Reagan and I have come up with a fun game to move your bodies using all of these different things we saw in the garden and all the different movements that they made, right? So come check out the next video and we're gonna show you how that works, okay? Bye.